Yeah, Mukhtar, today let's talk about our Playwright program in details. And uh, can you explain us what is Playwright, an AI program that we're doing inside you? Sure, absolutely. So we have launched this Playwright Upskill Training program. It's been like more than six months already. We completed like five batches. So this Playwright is one of the most popular automation tool nowadays. It is the alternative of Selenium, Cypress, and this Playwright is designed for end-to-end -end testing, which means it's capable of doing both front-end testing as well as the back-end testing. And if you look at the Playwright's development and also if you look at the growth of the Playwright, it just reminds you of the Selenium, right? Before Selenium, it was QTP. That was the most popular automation tool later on. Selenium came and it dethroned the QTP. And now Playwright is about to do the same for Selenium. Right now, Selenium is the number one automation tool because of its largest community base. However, if you compare Selenium's Playwright, Playwright has all those advantages such as fast execution, more user-friendly, okay? And plus it's also open source, which means it's free. So I think it's soon it's going to dethrone Selenium and become the number one automation tool. That's the reason why we launched this Playwright program to upskill our students. And that way it can also help them to have more job opportunities, right? And we want them to thrive in their career. The program is four weeks, correct? Right now, the program is six weeks. Initially, oh. it was about five weeks because initially we launched to play right with JavaScript only. Later on, we also added the TypeScript. So now in this program, you don't only learn play right with JavaScript, but also play right with TypeScript. It's a six-week part-time program you have been doing for five cohorts of students. Yes. And what was the benefit that it brought to our students? So through this program, they were able to see the complete new world of programming and automation because we heavily integrated the AI into our program. When it comes to programming, whether it's code generation, code completion, documentation, debugging, etc., we've been utilizing the AI to save up much more time. And plus, without the AI, there was just no way to complete this playwright, JavaScript, TypeScript, Jenkins, Git, those classes in six weeks. AI made it possible to complete it in six weeks. So the students, after they complete our program, they were really satisfied because of the AI integration into the course. So in the automation part, yes, they were also able to utilize the AI for so many repetitive tasks. We created like separate AI agents for separate tasks. Each AI agent is specialized for one particular task and our students, they utilize separate AI agents to do their automation tasks now. So in our previous podcast, we talk about Playwright versus Selenium automation yes. in very detail. So we're mm. going to leave a link in the description. You guys can check it out. It's not today's main topic. We're going to program. So in this program, you're not teaching Playwright automation. You're also teaching Playwright automation with AI yes. as well, making AI agents as well, I believe, JavaScript, TypeScript, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. That's absolutely right. So is there any prerequisite for this program? Who is this program for? If somebody's from scratch, don't have automation experience or somebody with experience like who are the people taking this program so we do have prerequisites for this course our prerequisites is you must have like close to intermediate level programming knowledge intermediate means by like you already know some of the core programming topics such as variables operators decision making class object inheritance arrays things like that and uh so that's the prerequisite for programming part. And we also have prerequisite for basic understanding of software testing. And also you should be familiar with what HTML is. You don't have to know the exact scripting in HTML. When you look at HTML code, for example, you need to be able to tell what is tag name, what is attribute, that's all. So it's very basic actually. So can I assume this program is designed for entry-level, mid-level, senior-level software quality assurance engineers or test automation engineers? Also, probably some developers or front-end developers as well, correct? Yes, correct. It's easier to, for them to learn learn those after it's because they already have like a intermediate level programming knowledge. So, so would you mind go through the the program details? I know we talk about it a little bit, but what programming languages we're learning, like what tools we're learning? Can you go over the details a little bit more? Absolutely. So, the programming language that are being taught in this program is JavaScript. JavaScript is one of them. Initially, we only included JavaScript in our previous cohorts, but this time we're also including TypeScript as well. So two programming languages are 
taught in this playwright automation program. Yeah, after learning JavaScript and TypeScript, you will also have playwright classes. So we teach both fundamentals and advanced techniques of playwright. And you will also have AI classes. AI classes it includes the utilization of Tab9 AI as well as the Perplex AI. Of course, we have lots of AI topics to cover. We cannot complete them in just one session. So we spread it out to six weeks of program, you know. JavaScript, TypeScript, Playwright, Tab9 AI, Perplex AI. And then you also have CICD classes where we learn how to run the Playwright tests with the Jenkins. So those are the tools that are taught. And once you get familiar, once you have comprehensive knowledge in, on, in all of those tools, then you will, during the program, you will also have one week of project implementation. So the project implementation week, in, during that week, you will be working with a behavior-driven framework. So we have Playwright BDD framework that's created, one with JavaScript, the other one with TypeScript. So you will get two separate versions of the frameworks. And we will also give you user stories for you to work on, for you to write test cases, and for you to automate. And the, the project that we are implementing in this during that week will be self-enrollment portal, which is a finance-based project. So after learning all those tools, then you will implement them in the actual project. So it's a during. real hands-on project. Yes. So those are what we teach in the six weeks of so Playwright Automation program. What is the format in this program? Is this live, in-person, online, video? Good question. So before it was fully live, but we had lots of problems that during that time because most of our students, they are working as an estet during the weekdays. They were having hard times to join the live class, right? But the weekend live classes, everybody was able to join. So this time around, what we did is we have recorded pretty much all the contents in the, at the production level. They are in the cinematic quality. So we all the concepts and fundamentals, we recorded them. And because we wanted to be able to implement the hybrid structure, which is one of the most successful structure that we had in our SIDO programs, right? So we implemented that into the Playwright. Now all the Playwright class are in the hybrid structure. During the weekdays, you have up to five hours of video classes to complete. After you complete those five hours of video classes, then on the weekend, you can join the live class. Live class usually lasts three to four hours. During live class, we only do hands-on practices, practical tasks. So basically, in the recording class, you will learn the fundamentals and concepts, and hands-on practices are done during live class. So five hours of recorded class, up to four hours of live class that you will have every week for six weeks. So it's all online? Yes. Yeah. Okay. So at the end of this program, are we getting any certification or anything like that? Yes. After you complete this program, you will get a certificate of completion. And that certificate of completion, it states all the tools, everything that all the trainings that you have done in this program, including the two programming language, Playwright, and two AI tools, Jenkins, Git, all those trainings, all those technical skills, everything will be included in the certificate of completion. Okay. So what is the tuition for this program? So the tuition of this program is $999. And if you are a first-time student, you will get $300 discount. You will need to use the promo code that we provide you during the intro sessions. Or if you want to get the promo code, yes, you can also reach out to our enrollment team. So after you use the promo code, if you are a first-time student, your tuition will drop to $699. So $699 is the tuition for first-time students. And if you are our alumni, we do provide alumni discount. All you have to do is when you register for the program, you need to provide the same email that you registered Sideo with when you first joined the Sideo. Okay. So there are a couple input fields where you will provide your first name, last name, email address. If you are our alumni, make sure you provide the same exact information that you registered Sideo with, and then you will get the alumni discount. So we have lots of students there. I mean, alumni are working full time and some of them, they pay for the tuition, they want to learn, they just get very busy and they cannot keep up with the schedule. But some of them may want to ask for a refund. Is there any refund period for this program? Yes, we have two weeks to refund policy. If, okay. if you didn't like the program or if you think this is not the right program for you at all, then yes, you can ask for refund. We will give you 100% money back. So if you want to sign up for this program, how do I enroll to this program? 
Well, enrolling into this program is pretty easy. You can just do self-enrollment. So you go to our website, sideo.com. Under this upskill training session, you will be able to find a playwright automation with AI. So, and from there, there's a register now button. You click it. Afterwards, it's going to take you to a different a link, uh, the self-enrollment portal. And in that portal, you provide your information, first name, last name, phone number, email address. And then when you click the next button, it's going to take you to the payment plan. But remember, in the payment plan, there are two payment plan options that are available. If you want the discount to be applicable, you must select the upfront payment plan. And then afterwards, you can check out with either with card or bank account. The only difference is when you check out with the card, there's a processing fee. So usually I recommend students to just check out with the bank account because there won't be any processing fee if you check out with the bank account. Okay. Thank you for watching our intro session today. For those who want to learn more about the Playwright program, and we're going to put the description. Whoever want to learn more about why Playwright is important and it's taking over the market, mm -hmm. uh, we have done podcasts earlier. We're going to just put in the description. Our Playwright podcast will be in the description as well as our checkout link will be in, in the description as well. You can sign up from there. Is there anything else you want to add? So looking forward to see you all in the Playwright Automation program. And I'll be the instructor to teach all the tools, whether it's programming language or Playwright itself, AI tools. I'll be teaching them all. And all those tools, they are going to be more in demand in the near future. And you will have much more opportunity in the future if you have those tools on your resume. After completing the, this program, you will be able to add two programming languages on top of whatever the programming language that you have on your resume. And you will be able to add Playwright on top of the Selenium or Cypress that you have. And plus, you will also be able to mention Perplex AI as well as Tab9 AI, those technical tools. Thank you so much. Looking forward to see you all in class. Okay, guys, as I always say, the more you learn, the more you earn. See you in the classroom, guys. Take care. See you. Take care.